Uh, my name is Prasit Trivedi and I have secured All India rank of 3,270 in NEET 2022. I have scored 6, uh, 656 marks out of 720. Uh, my parents are occupied in... Uh, my father is a government uh, officer in post department and my mother is a housewife. I have completed my 11th and 12th science under the guidance of Samadhu Academy of Science. It has been a wonderful experience to study under this team. Uh, I have uh, procured much guidance uh, throughout um, my journey of 11th and 12th science. Every teacher and faculties have been very much supportive uh, in each and every step, each and every um, uh, aspect of this journey. Uh, even the smallest crew member of this team has uh, supported uh, in its whole complete way uh, the doubts, the, uh, the lecture timings, everything was uh, done very smoothly to avoid any hurdles in our journey. I have secured, as I said, 656 marks out of 720 in NEET 2022. The main uh, people responsible for uh, giving out these results, I would say, are firstly my parents and secondly my faculties. Uh, my parents have obviously devoted much time and their um, patience, their money towards uh, bringing out this result. Uh, they have created, they had created such an environment in, uh, in my house also so that I can uh, study smoothly even in the school as I uh, stayed my much, of, much time uh, of the day in my school. So the school timings and school environment was created in such a way by all the faculties and by all the team members so that students can focus towards their goal and achieve what they have dreamed of uh, in the beginning of the journey. So I would say the Samatwe team and my parents are mainly responsible for my this result. Uh, as I said, the faculties over in this academy are really very helpful in each and every way, not just in the studies, in, in uh, tackling every problem that a student faces in this journey because it's not a small time span, it's uh, a time span of two years or more than two years. So even when we started our 11th, it was the time of uh, COVID and uh, we were having our classes at home but even during those times the management and the faculties assured us in every manner they had uh, a fixed timing for lectures so that uh, we don't face any issue of uh, the syllabus not being completed or time or the doubt and everything. Everything was going very smoothly even during those times and after then uh, when the schools reopened everything was planned and uh, made in such a way in the school itself that uh, students, each and every students get uh, personal guidance and uh, they get personal time towards faculties for uh, doubt solving and uh, lectures and everything. So firstly, when uh, we began our 11th science, uh, so we were uh, studying from home itself in the COVID times. Uh, at, th at those times, the material were provided to us um, in the online mode, but it was done in such a manner that students can uh, do it in parts because when you enter from 10th to 11th and 12th science, the environment is whole different. Uh, it, a student needs time to get uh, used to the timetable and used to that uh, the process that 11th and 12th science students must go through each and every day. So everything was provided in such a manner in the initial period that uh, a student coming from 10th can get used to it. Like everything was provided in small packets so that we can get used to what we have to uh, do afterwards. 
and uh, the materials and modules which were provided by Samath Academy were uh, full enough for a uh, neat preparation. In uh, firstly, if I talk about physics, I had only done the modules given by Samath Academy, and uh, then after uh, in my uh, like lastly when we had uh, mock rounds of full syllabus, I had done DC Pandey, which is optional. Otherwise, the modules were completely enough. There were um, hundreds of MCQs, and the theory was also enough for um, need preparation. Nextly, if I talk about chemistry, chemistry modules were more than enough for need. I had not done any other thing except uh, the modules given by Samath Academy. They were completely uh, need oriented, and uh, it was. Uh, Planned, it was made in such a way that uh, it had a gradient in its MCQs. So uh, when you firstly approach a chapter, approach a topic, there has to be a, a low, uh, low level and then it uh, goes on increasing with each and every uh, topic and each and every section. So in chemistry, as I would say just modules I had done and uh, PYQ in every subject. Uh, PYQs are very important. And uh, for biology, just I had done need uh, like NCRT. It was more than enough. NCRT is like uh, need is come all about NCRT in biology. So it was said to us from Samatva Academy uh, like team that just focus on NCRT and that's what I did. I had just uh, done NCRT in biology. Uh, no other modules or no other materials. It was just this. In Samatva Academy of Science, the reading environment is um, very much fruitful. The lecture, uh, the after each and every lecture, you get uh, some amount of time to uh, uh, go through the whole lecture, to go through the whole notes that you have made during the lecture because that's very important to make notes and go through them and uh, uh, write like. Uh, go through all the concepts and uh, fix it into your minds and then if a student faces any doubt or anything it uh, goes to your reading lecture you have to like go through a whole lecture in the reading and then uh, the doubt lecture commences so reading is obviously the most important thing during 11th and 12th science because most of the time you are um, spending uh, in your of your day in your school so reading has to be very good and that is very uh, that that is taken very good care here uh, usually in initial days there is reading of about three four hours and then uh, when this journey goes ahead of 11th and 12th science once the syllabus completes it uh, stretches for like six seven hours obviously in the day so and uh, it is taken care that there is no any nuisance or no any uh, hurdles in readings even if a student needs uh, some personal space in reading that is provided by the team so overall reading experience is very good over here and i would say it's i think one of the best reading experience in uh, whole bhavnagar you can have So, as I said, doubts are obviously an inevitable part in this 11th and 12th science or in any course you go. So, firstly, we used to have lectures, as I said, in the morning session, we used to have lectures. And then after, uh, we, have given, we, had, we had given time so that we could go through whole lecture and then the doubt lecture commences, like they, uh, we had sections. Uh, we had fixed timings of each and every subject in a day or in a week it was uh, divided if there is uh, if a teacher is not if faculty is not free we had uh, timings in a week like weekly once or weekly twice we had to write down our doubts in a, in a different way or we have to mark it down so that when the doubt lecture comes it um, uh, passes out smoothly and our doubts get solved uh, usually there, uh, there was no like thing uh, that toppers or uh, had 
first approach to any faculty there was no such thing we all have, were treated equally in doubt session uh, if there is a long queue we had to register our names in the book itself and then uh, as per every student term, turn comes they had to go to the faculty and uh, their doubts get solved and each and every student was given enough time and enough care from each and every faculty so that uh, no student uh, feels any kind of under taken or anything the doubts were completely solved even in the covid times when we were at home doubts were solved online by every teacher and if uh, we needed they even called us uh, so there was a perfect system of doubt solving so as i said i have 650 plus marks in need so i am aspiring to take admission in mbbs uh, in uh, top 5 colleges of aims or in jipmer uh, for that in, in uh, initially only i had uh, i had goal of securing 650 plus marks so it wasn't a journey like i had always scored above 600 or that it uh, began from 640 marks initially and then uh, with support of every faculty and um, every team member i reached to my goal so obviously i'm thankful to them and i dream to take um, mbbs uh, ahead in my life so the students currently enrolled in samatwa academy i would say you have chosen the best institute in uh, bhavnagar to pass this journey and i would say it's the best institute where each and every student gets personal guidance from each and every faculty the faculties are very hospitable and very caring uh, when it comes to your dreams when it comes to your goals but the one thing is essential that you have to have a goal you it's not like that that you are coming and just going uh, you are coming in at 8 and you are going at uh, in evening at 6 it's, it's not like that you have to come with a goal every day you have to remind yourself about the goal and uh, if you are having a goal i'm sure that the teacher every faculty here will do their 100% to make you reach to your goal uh, even at times they may be harsh they may be strict towards you but uh, ultimately it's for your good and for your um, success all matters is your success at the end of the day so i wish every every student uh, studying at samatwa academy of science a very best of luck for their future and uh, keep growing in your life thank you